Dominican Navy sailors aboard the three vessels anchored here in the TCI, including this one, the Orion docked here at the Turtle Cove Marina, continue to enjoy some leisure time, and tonight they're dining with the governor. After an honorary entrance, the 150 Navy sailors had cocktails with His Excellency Gordon Weatherall and entertained him and attendees by playing the accordion, guitars and cultural merengue music. Well, this is a very welcome visit. The Dominican Republic is a neighbor and a friend of the Turks and Caicos Islands. And we have many uh, similar uh, interests in terms of the security of the region as a whole in combating the same scourges of drug trafficking and so on. So I think it's good to have this, uh, this visit uh, here. It can only improve understanding and cooperation between the two countries. The governor wasn't the only one pleased with the ties between the two countries, but Superintendent of the Dominican Naval Academy, Carlos Calis, was touched by the support from the Dominican community in the TCI. Uh, as soon as we arrived here, We've been receiving the support from the Dominican community and the Turkey Kaiko people. And for us, it has been a big, uh, beautiful experience sailing this water and share with all of you and try to enhance our friendship in the Caribbean. Presentations of plaques were exchanged between the governor and the Naval Academy superintendent, who also gave His Excellency a replica of the ship's steering wheel. Presentations were also made by the TCI Softball Federation and the TCI Marine Branch. Commissioner of the TCI Marine Branch, Neil Hall, who has also served in naval ships, said the visit shows the brotherhood of the sea because they both share a common cause of keeping the sea safe. Discussions were made into having both countries interact more, and Hall said that the TCI Marine Branch could also use a mothership. Do you know, if I, if I had the money, I would go out and buy one tomorrow, you know that. Um, yeah, we could really use uh, a ship the same sort of size as the, uh, the Orion, the patrol boat here, as a, and that would act as a mothership for the size of our maritime forces. Um, Unfortunately, as you know, with the financial situation in the country at the moment, that's not going to happen uh, in the near future. Meanwhile, there was a definite show of patriotism as Dominican nationals were in full support of the entire visit. They can be like an open door from here and, and, the, and the, this government and the Dominican government and we can cheer together cultural sport and everything we need. I feel very good. I see the two families together. Dominican Republic, my brother, and Torso Keiko people, my brother too. I like that, this continue, not only okay. one time, this continue forever. I'm happy, and I'm going to dance the whole night to show them that I'm proud of them though. I like very happy because you see my people from DIA come here, they say the same family, DIA and Taimenta Son Keiko. The Navy crew will continue their 22-day training mission in the morning, and it is clear that tonight they had a wonderful time. On the Orion Navy vessel, for WIV4 News, I'm Nakira John.